Since making his debut on The Cobbles last year, Coronation Street fans have watched Stephen Reed, played by Todd Boyce, turn to drastic action to keep his secrets from being exposed. He's already murdered Leo Tompkins, Joe Frost, and his dad Teddy, Grant Bergen, and it looks as though the serial killer has his sights set on another potential victim. The Canadian businessman has been drugging Carla Connor, Alison King, over the past few months in an attempt to take over her role at the Underworld factory. However, his scheming ways were almost exposed when Rufus Donahue, Steve Mayhew, threatened to tell everyone about the spiking unless he stopped the American contract. Intending to attack with a hunch pole laid in anger, Rufus nearly became the third victim on Stephen's roster but he got a lucky escape when a worker interrupted them. Although in recent scenes, worker Michael Bailey, Ryan Russell, discovered it was Stephen who had cut ties with American Zoan and Angelique, not the other way around as he had implied. Confronting the Canadian businessman about the future of Underworld, Stephen continued to spout lies at Michael as he told him Rufus made a better offer he couldn't refuse. Wanting to try and keep the Americans on side, Michael managed to get Owen and Angelique to up their original offer and a better deal for the factory. However, Stephen had to appear happy with the news as he came up with a counter-offer for Rufus to keep him from revealing all about the drug spiking. In the end, Stephen offered Rufus 10% of the profit that Underworld would make with the new business deal. Realizing Stephen had to bow down to his demands, Rufus asked for a steep 25% instead, which the killer had to agree to. Gloating at the high profit he'd be getting after blackmailing Stephen, the camera showed the murderer's menacing stare, suggesting he plotting something evil once again. With Todd Boyce revealing Stephen will kill again, viewers quickly took to Twitter to fear Michael could be next on the list after renegotiating the deal with the Americans, resulting in Rufus getting a huge profit. Priya underscore core underscore UK said, Michael had better be careful. He might be Stephen's next victim. Hashtag Corey don't miss. Immerdale's Rona Gosker crocked by ex-husband's arrival, latest, Coronation Street's Greg Dinker and Faye in trouble after confession, latest, Antiques Road Trip host Warren's tears are about to roll after loss, latest, Georgia Boring added, hashtag Corey Michael will be Stephen's next victim. Martin Leyland Zero tweeted, Michael set to be hammered over the head with a shovel. As Stephen closes in, hashtag Corey Ryan the Soap King questioned, could Michael be the key to Stephen's downfall? I reckon he'll find something out about Stephen maybe the LSD. Hashtag Corey. The Soap star told the Mirror that another Weatherfield resident will be killed in April with him teasing it won't stop there. He said, after that, I think there could be more, he has a taste for it now. I think he figures that if he gets caught for three, he might as well get caught for four or five. It would be great to go down in the record books as the show's biggest serial killer. What a thing to be known for. However, Coronation Street boss Ian McLeod revealed Stephen's terror will eventually come to an end as he told the Loose Women panel earlier this year. Presenter Denise Welch questioned whether or not viewers will see the killer pay the price for his crimes, Ian confessed he will. He said, of course he is. It's a soap, bad guys always get their comeuppance in the end, don't they? So yes, 100%. There's a lot of fun to be had between now and then I will say. Coronation Street continues Mondays, Wednesdays and Fridays on ITVX and ITV1 at 8pm.